Hey there, this is Mr. Icarus, and welcome back to yet another episode of Icarus Plays Doom 2016. And we're going to kick this one off with a death-defying feat. A death-defying feat, even. I think I said deaf in terms of not being able to hear. We're definitely going to be able to, able to hear the effect of this, especially if I die. There will be a lot of swearing, and... Oh, jeez. Fuck it. Fuck. Fuck! There we go! There was a lot of swearing either way, because I was convinced that that was going to result in a terrible, horrible death. But we've got an extra Praetor Suit token for our troubles. I am feeling so relieved right now. So relieved. I was worried that I'd have to do a, a checkpoint restart, and nobody wants to do a checkpoint restart. Uh, yes! Now, the reason why I couldn't just do that back to the other side is because that, that ledge is ever so slightly higher than the ledge I've just leapt back to, and um, I died a few times testing that method out, so um, yeah, that's why I, I didn't just do that the first time round. We're going to do a little bit more exploring, just checking a few more nook and crannies in this area, and then we're going to get cracking with uh, the new section of the Argent facility, because up until now it's, it's largely been backtracking through areas we've already explored, even though the you know, completely broken and on fire. Uh, so which way do I need to go now? Generally, I think I should head in this direction. I think I need to stay on this level up here. And I'm pretty sure I've done all of the arena encounters so far. So yeah, we need to go through this airlock. And this will be uh, uncharted territory. In terms of what we've already seen. But as usual, the interior decoration is just absolutely fantastic. Uh, I am very happy that that corpse is wearing a safety hat. Safety first, no matter what you're doing, even if you're dead. Now, through here, we're, we're going to have to deal with some very, very angry and very, very pink demons. And I'm going to show you my secret to dealing with these guys. And trust me, it's a 100% guaranteed method of dealing with pinkies. If you stick to this method, you won't die anywhere near as much, apart from if you get headbutted in mid-air, which is uh, what I did there. And yeah, it's going horribly. It's going very much horribly. Basically, plan B, because plan A isn't working out very well for me here, is um, get the siege cannon out, get as much freaking distance between these juggernauts as you can, and uh, shoot them in the ass, if, if possible. Shoot them in the ass. That is what I was going to show you. But it all went to hell. But there you go, that's one. That's one that got shot in the ass. And pinkies go down relatively fast if you just stick to that simple rule. Shoot them in the bit that's pink. Which is generally their ass. I've said ass quite a lot in this particular section. I apologize for any of you sensitive to the word ass or buttocks or rear or derriere, but um, screw you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna say ass as many times as I like. But this is where you'd normally pick up the chain gun if you uh, forgot to pick it up in hell, you know, as you do when you're doing a shopping for weaponry. And, yeah, we should probably activate this. Which will show us what we need to track down. There's this poor git down here who has our tram key card. And he, he just buggers off. As you do. Really, Vega. That is an astute observation. But I think that means we've done a lot of challenges as well, so that is awesome. Yep, we've done our challenges. We've got two more elite guards to find. Uh, hmm. I think they're all on the way, to be honest, so we don't really have to worry about much. My mini-map told me that there was something down here. I think it's the auto-map terminal. It is. I can nearly miss that. Nearly completely missed it. And now we've also got... The hologram uh, grenade, which I'll show you what it does. If you chuck it, it, puts a hologram of you down. This is basically... Actually, I, I thought it was supposed to reflect your multiplayer character, but um, obviously not. Obviously not. So, this will take us back through to the outside, and wouldn't you know it, we got a bit of quad damage. Hi, pinkies. You're gonna die. A lot quicker than before. <laughs> I do love the glory kill animations, Pinkies. They are uh, wonderfully hardcore. And you know what? I'm going to switch, 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 swatch over to the plasma. What? No! You son of a bitch! Fuck! 
Yo, how dare you crash? Bugger bollocks. This is, I think this is like the second crash that I've had while playing this now, but all you can do is say thank you very much for the checkpoint system and just carry on kicking ass. There's no other way you can do it. Dust yourself off. I, I was going to say learn from your mistakes, but that, that wasn't my fault this time. <laughs> I wasn't making a really stupid jump over a gorge I have n no chance of, of getting across. This time it's all on Doom. So Doom, you've been a real bitch today, but you know what? I'm going to forgive you. I'm going to let you off on that one. And I didn't really get much use out of my quad damage there, did I? <laughs> We've got a lot of imps, and I'm pretty sure there is a revenant or two around here to deal with as well. If I leap down here, switch over to the old Gauss Cannon. Where are you? Hey, here's my buddy. Here's my old pal. I like to secretly think that you're facing against the same four or five revenants throughout the entire game. And they just have to respawn in hell. It's a very, very painful process. And they have to drag themselves all the way back up to the surface of Mars. Only to have you cave their faces in over and over and over and over. That's my pet theory. That's my pet theory. And that is why they're all so shit scared of the Doom Slayer. But this is another Praetor Suit token. Does that, did that put us up to three? Two. Two tokens. So, we could do something with the equipment. Now that we've got more than one thing in here, we might as well use the quick charge upgrade. And uh, that could come in handy later on. Actually, I haven't picked up the, the hologram thing. My checkpoint thing didn't, uh, didn't let me do it. There it is. That's what I was looking for. These bloody game crashes, they really throw you off kilter, but at least I've got my challenges complete. At least I've got all the tokens I need for my weapons. Is there anything else we can upgrade? Longer stun, why not? That gives us access to the mastery challenge. Chain stun, demons killed while stunned will release a secondary stun uh, that affects nearby demons. Like stunception. Stuns within stuns within stuns. Hopefully we can get some entertaining mileage out of that one. But I think up the top here is going to be another fairly involved fight. So I'm going to have to get my game face on. There's the holographic pinky. Running away with my friggin' tram key. And you know what? I am totally wasting ammo by doing that, but not when it comes to revenants. Oh shit. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just so paranoid of caca demons now. Every time I see one spawn, I think there's gotta be another one. I have this thing where I, I, I keep feeling like they're supposed to spawn in purrs. One of them flanks you while you're dealing with one of the other fatties directly in front. Right! Got another revenant. I'm okay with revenants. Revenants are easy enough to deal with. I say that, it could completely just rip my arms off and, and bludgeon me to death. Oh, there's the other caco. I knew there was another one. Son of a bitch. Right, that's his fire. I'm just trying to keep track of when he's launched his attack because then that means I've got a little bit of a window in order to uh, change weapons. Get myself ready for the next section. And do I have enough chainsaw? He charged at me quick. I was looking away. <laughs> I was honestly looking away when that thing just charged at me. Uh, that, that was very startling. Bad, Pinky. Bad. But at least I have... Whoa. That's not normal. That's not normal at all. Oh, no. Now he's... Now he's... <laughs> <laughs> now he's actually doing some sort of movement. I'm pretty sure the crash really uh, screwed a few things up. But hopefully we should resume normal duty after this. I blame it on hell energy. That That's, that's really what goes wrong here. When, whenever anything screws up or you experience a glitch, just blame it on hell energy. That's the only thing you need to use as an excuse. So... How am I doing for secrets? There's still a few left to discover. There's an Argent cell as well that I need. Is there an Argent cell around here? There is! It's up there. As is a collectible. So hopefully we can get that. Oh, there is another PDA thing here. That's nice. And the other uh, Gauss cannon as well. Oh, there's the upgrade drone. Let's catch it! Let's try and catch it and shoot down. God damn. It's a shame you can't stop it from floating off into a really awkward place, but oh well. What are you gonna do? 
just gonna have to carry on murdering demons. I jest, but I'm really gonna have to focus here because we are about to face a Baron or two because uh, Gore Nest start to release uh, heftier and heftier quantities of enemies. And we got Pinkies, we got Barons, we got all sorts of uh, irritating bastards to deal with here. Oh, hello. Good night. Trouble me no more, you absolute son of a bitch. I've got no ammo, there's no point in using that. Avoid the Hellraiser. I'm just going to be calling my shots from this point onwards because that is all I can do <laughs> in order to stay alive. Because things are getting hairy. And I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be a Baron around here. Where is the Baron? All I'm seeing is Hell Knights. It's making me feel a little on edge. Where are you? Where is the big kahuna? He's around here somewhere. I can hear the music. It's still going. There he is. Big, red, and angry. And hopefully... Dead. No, no, he's still alive. How about now? Yeah, that'll do. That works. <laughs> Phew! That was a little hairy. And they're only going to get hairier from this point onwards. So we need to get the yellow key. And we also need to get over to the other side of this thing. Reset crane. Actually, this will help us get the, uh, the drone upgrade. And I definitely want to do that before I head outside. A little bit more chainsaw. We've already got tons and tons and tons of health. But if we jump over here... Climb over this, and then leap up here. We'll find another secret. So that's another one done. There's an upgrade drone. I think I'll have the mobile turret, thank you very much. Because I effing love the mobile turret. Look at it. Look at it, it's so nice. It's even better when you do this. Oh, that is sexual. Sorry, things got a little weird. But honestly, I really like that. I really, 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 really like that. Because it just, it just carves through them. Like butter. Glorious. And this is where we actually gain access to the other rune trial, believe it or not. So if we head around this side, this basically lets us do a big circle of the facility. That's where uh, we started. And this is the other rune trial. So what do we got? We got armor defensive. Killing glory, de uh, glory killing demons drops armor. So combat shotgun eliminates all targets. Health levels are critical. Use armor to survive. Hmm. This is going to be tricky. Going to be honest with you guys, I don't have a lot of experience with this rune trial. I maybe did it once and then forgot all about it. But because you're dealing with possessed, you, you, you may be thinking, ah, I can deal with this. This is going to be fairly easy. That is where you are wrong because you only have one health and that is a hell knight. <laughs> no, 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 no. That is not fair, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> that is not fair at all. He's just gonna stop me to death, isn't he? Let's try that again. I've already said in the past that uh, rune trials aren't really that difficult, and this right here is making a fool of me. Good damn, uh, good damn, good sir. It is making a fool of me, and I really need to get rid of this hell knight. Breathe in, breathe out. Try not to take any friggin uh, fireballs to the face. We, we've got to use armor. That is the critical thing to remember here. Armor will save our lives. As well as dodging out of the way of big angry sons of bitches. So we have got an angry uh, soldier possessed. He's done. Oh god it's a pinky. This I do not remember this. I think I actually missed this last time. We've got a few more kills left. Maybe if we ignore the pinky, he'll just go away. That's what I'm secretly hoping, unless he's the last thing I've got to kill. <laughs> oh, you son of a bitch. I'm running out of time. I'm running out of time. Yes! Oh, that was close. <laughs> that was far too close. Well, that was a little more effort than I anticipated. Uh, but now we have that extra rune. I'm, I'm very, very eager to, to collect as many of those runes as possible. Ooh, nearly fell down to the lower level there. I don't want that happening. That'd mean I'd have to <laughs> re-navigate, re-circumnavigate the entire friggin' level, and uh, I don't want to be doing that, quite frankly. I wish not to be bothered with that kind of bollocks. 
in my let's plays. But I do need more ammo. And we got cacos. I'm so happy that I'm not rooted to the spot with this thing. I'm so happy to be wrong. <laughs> so, we've got a few secrets that we can uncover here as well. There is an Argent Energy Cell up top, and I think I'm close enough to the end of the level here. Usually, I'd be wrapping up the video by this point, but I think I'm close enough to the end where I can just steam through this and uh, get shit done. Get business all sorted. So, where is it? It is here. And what have we got left to upgrade, actually? I think we're pretty near the end in terms of the upgrade tree with the uh, with the Argent Energy Cells. Let's see. We've got full ammo. I'm pretty sure of it. Is it? No, no, we're not full yet. Mm. I will probably up the armor, to be perfectly honest. The, I, I, I've, been, I've been reawakened to the importance of armor, especially when it comes to, to having very low bits of health. I done goofed. You know when you look at a ledge and you think I can do that? That looks like a climbable ledge. Never, never, ever, ever go with that instinct. And there's a Hell Knight already. That is an early showing for that kind of goon. But he's dead. We haven't even activated the, uh, the gore nest yet. And I'm pretty sure that's gonna result in a few cacos. Sod it. Let's do this. I'm going to switch over to the old Gauss Cannon. And thankfully, we also have a, uh, a full quota of the Chainsaw Ammunition, so we can definitely default to that if we need to. And ideally, I'm going to also try to kill a few things while in mid-air. I am an absolute spaz with this at the moment. But you've had your fireball. Ah, oh, no! Never underestimate how quickly a Kako can recharge his, uh, his fireball attack. Just shoot him until he starts glowing and then just gouge his friggin' eyes out. Lovely. That counts as in-flight mobility. I'm very happy with that. And one more hit, maybe. There we go. Glory kill for my trouble. And I think... Ooh. We've got another Kako. They just keep coming. They're getting more and more frequent. I think there's... Jeez. They're throwing everything they can at me. I think they think I'm a threat. I don't know why they'd think that. It's not like there were information totems in Hell detailing the chronicles of the Doomslayer as he ravaged the absolute shit out of demon kind. That's right, bitches. I'm the Doomslayer, and you're all going back. Postage paid. Return to sender. Well, that's that done. <laughs> Another weapon upgrade point, and we've got our full quota of weapon upgrade points as well, which is lovely. So, what does that mean exactly? That means we've got one more secret left to find. Uh, ooh, is it up here? I think it is. There we go. Last secret. And an ice cream truck going past. Hopefully you can't hear that on the audio. <laughs> I'm not going to be stopping this video short to go out and get some ice cream. Um, it is bloody hot right now, but I'm okay finishing this level. And that, that pinky clearly died to indigestion. Just going to... Take this back. Yeah. Cheers. So that's that job done. We've now got the yellow key card. Ooh, what's this? You cannot send a team in to retrieve it. I am the head of this corporation. All your work and discoveries here belong to me. Yeah. Mine before you even found him. You tell him. Eh, her. Whatever she is. Z, Z, whatever gender she identifies as. I have no friggin' idea. But she's the one that opened hell. She's clearly a really big dumbass. Yeah, definitely get that extra stuff. And if we drop down here, where does that leave us? Oh, shit. That was a little startling. Leaves us on a platform that collapses, but yeah. It was trying to direct us away from this, which is an extra Praetor suit token, which you definitely want. That means we now have all of the things. God damn, I am happy to have all of the things. And there is only one direction left to go, which is through here. One last confrontation, but I'm thinking, I'm thinking we can do this. I'm thinking we're good, as long as there aren't too many pinkies, because I've clearly, clearly displayed my ineptitude for dealing with pinkies. But anyway, let's mow the grass. Oh, I've overheated. This is, this is why the, uh, 
the extra upgrade trees for this are, are very, very useful. You want to reduce that cooldown time. You want to reduce the time it takes for it to actually overheat in the first place. And, uh, yeah. You go, exploding possessed. <laughs> you do whatever you want to do, because it's certainly not bothering me. Is that everyone? Is that mostly everyone? We're good. Lovely. Please be seated. The tram is now ready to depart. It's almost like I'm at Disneyland all over again. We get to ride the tram. Destination. Cool. Well, thank you very much for watching and bearing with me through all these crashes and abject failures. But this has been Mr. Icarus. Hopefully you've enjoyed watching this episode of Icarus Plays Doom 2016. Hope to see you in the next episode. Icarus out.